a bit of work on the way, but we're... No, a bit of gardening. Why not? Just here, up in the caravan, because we've got something going on up on the back pad. And I've got to tell you, thank God, something's here. Let's go have a look. Hello, puppy girl. Hello, puppy girl. Hello, little puppy girl. That's the builder's dog. And the building that's going on is Yep, well, shed's on its way. Getting the shed put up and I'll keep you informed of how it's going photo by photo. Folks, as the sun sinks slowly in the west, that's the uh, work for the day on the shed. It is the weekend, so not much will be going on over the weekend, but progress is happening. Um, you're going to see this girl come to pieces and form a beautiful shed that we'll be able to get the caravan in and uh, keep it under cover and a lot of other stuff too and away from floods and god knows what else so pretty happy with the uh stuff that's going on so far there'll be a crane here next week to do the heavy lifting of all the uh top stuff um so yeah anyway till the next uh section when i get to record a little bit more I'll leave you with that
Victoria to build the uh, tent. Progress is being made rapidly. It's coming up really fast and I'm really happy because by the end of the week, this video will be out and the shirt will be finished. I'll just take it for a quick look. Unreal. Crazy, isn't it? Well, we'll have a look at day four, obviously, shortly. Your bag.
So, there it is, viewers. In the caravan. And what I'm about to show you is that the shed is done. Let's go outside and have a look. Yep, she's up. Caravan's in. And she fits just nicely. Tow bar's just hanging out by a fraction, doesn't matter. There's room to walk around. Buggy's in, the boat's in, and drum kit. <laughs> so I can make noise and just tick off the neighbors. But she's done. It's so nice to have this finished. And I'll just go for a walk around and show you. Got the door through here. Leads in to the workshop. Haven't got anything sorted out yet. Couple of shelves in there. Big roller door. Of course, later on, I'll put two windows down that side. Let a bit of light in. And after having all this done, I'm so wrapped. This has come up really good. A little door at the back here. This takes us to the outside world. Bit of earthwork still going on. We'll need a tank down here to catch this water because this thing's gonna catch a lot of water. A few spare bits of steel laying around which I can utilize. But that's it, she's done. Bit more land clearing, and that's happening as we're talking. We are up here the other week, dragged some good logs out of the bush. Excavator's over here in the corner. She's about to go to work, but been clearing, getting a whole heap of wood out. But the main thing is, the shed is up. And sooner or later, we're going to have a nice big fire out here. I'm getting a nice big uh, section. Plenty of wood. More wood. And a big pile over here to burn. But that's her. So, once again, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed. The shed was just a bonus for us out here because we'll be able to stay out here and have a holiday, I guess on your own block. Why not when you've got 40 acres? Keep the quiet down, don't have to hear the traffic off the road. Neighbours won't hear, I can play the drums, make some noise. But there she is. So, if you like the video, hit the thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. And uh, there'll be another one, a bit of a montage coming up. Um, basically just about the house. It's good to have something different every week. Good to have a video, you know, that I can pump out, make it new, something different instead of the same thing over and over. Anyway, that's it. So, once again, catch you on the next one. Thanks, guys.